y'all welcome back to my channel i am back with another video you want to say what's up say what's up, what's up? <laughs> that's my nephew y'all his name is tj all right y'all so i am having a seafood boil Alright y'all, so if y'all pay attention to my first video, I told you that crab legs was my favorite meal. And <laughs> we're having a seafood boy. So I've got my water over here boiling. And these are my ingredients. So right now I'm over here prepping my red potatoes. I've got my shrimp 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 in her unthawing so i'm going to continue making my red potatoes all right all right so with my red potatoes i like to get the small ones because it's easier once they're done making to bite to bite to bite <laughs> all right y'all hey Tell him your name. Tell him your name. This is TJ, my nephew. Say hello, TJ. chives in there. This is the Kroger brand chives. You ain't gotta be fancy or whatever. It, it's gotta be fancy. <laughs> That's TJ, y'all. Alright, chives are in there. Um, and we need these. The, the, what is this? This is garlic cloves. That's gonna be next. So I've got some Obey. Obey. 
Old Bay. Old Bay. You can get this at Walmart or Kroger. They always sell this. Old Bay. Like I said, I like mine for the taste. I'm gonna cut up some garlic cloves. I've only got three. Oh, I've got four. So, I cut my garlic cloves into pieces. Or four of them. Let me go wash my hands. All right, so now I'm going to mix all this around. <coughs> Mixing all this around. Woo. All this good seasoning and I like mine real well seasoned. Woo. It's got me up for sneezing, y'all. It's that goodness cooking, that goodness. to add a stick of butter butter make it better real good mm -hmm. just gonna put the whole thing in there Ooh. let me wash my hands again guys so I'm going to mix this up some more this is just cooking y'all real good real good cooking real good real good Cooking real good, real good. Cooking real good. Can't even find a stick of butter. It's in there melting. May have to turn on the fan, y'all, because it's really smoking in here. So now I'm gonna add in my red potatoes. So I've got my red potatoes in there, and you're gonna make sure you stir them up, and you have to actually watch them. They're in here boiling, boiling, boiling. So while my potatoes are boiling, I'm going to go ahead and um, prep my sausage, my turkey sausages that I got from Walmart. I'm gonna go ahead and um, cut those this on there for now. There's one thing I forgot to add. I forgot to add my sweet onion. So I'm gonna chop this up real fast and add it in there. So I got some onions cut up. I'm just gonna add these onions into the boil. Oh no! So those are the onions getting added in there. Okay, so now I'm gonna wash my hands and get this onion smell off. Now, I'm going to mix all this around and check on my potatoes. If I can find it, find them. I keep picking up um, this. My phone's just going. I keep picking up this instead of my uh, potatoes. So let me check on my potatoes. Uh oh, they're boiling. Let me get a fork or something. Uh, they could cook longer. So I'm gonna put the top back on. Let it cook a little longer. While we're waiting on this. I'm gonna go back to cooking my sausages. <clears throat> and I'm gonna put my onion in my little cute little onion holder. I got it at Walmart or at Kroger. All right guys, so it's over here steaming, so I need to check on it. Woo! <laughs> it's cooking in here, y'all. <clears throat> it's going down.
says, this is what I keep fishing for. Oh, see, I told you, here's a potato. Okay, I'm gonna use this to fish around in here. Oh, there's nothing in there. All right, guys, so I'm gonna put this back in there. I am going to make my own sauce. So I'm gonna turn this on and I'm gonna start off with <clears throat> some onions and butter. This butter's been sitting out so it's kind of melted. So I'm gonna add in two sticks of butter. Can't believe it's not butter. I think I might add, well, I think this is enough butter, or sorry, enough onions. Okay guys, so now I'm going to add in some pepper. And again, I do mine, I don't measure anything. I literally just wing it, cayenne pepper. So I'm really just putting in the same seasonings I use for the, um, the boil. Some garlic powder. Garlic powder. Um, Cajun. Seasoning. Um, some more Creole. Obey. Mine. Real 
garlicky, so I think I'm gonna add some more garlic. Mm. And I also have a timer on my um, crab legs and shrimp. So I've got about a minute and 40 something seconds left. So I'm also keeping track of that. So I'm also, oh, and my boiled eggs. And I'm also gonna add some chives. I love chives. No, that was a lot. <laughs> so my chives. I really love garlic, so I think I'm gonna add some more. Ooh. Love garlic. And I think I'm gonna add another elastic of butter because I need more. more stick of butter. Alright guys, so this is the finishing product of my seafood boil. Everything turned out amazing. So guys, go ahead and give this video a thumbs up. Comment down below if you've ever made a seafood boil or if you've ever made your own sauce to a seafood boil. Make sure you guys subscribe to my channel, please. Um, make sure you all also follow me on Instagram at underscore underscore Jamia C. Make sure that you are also follow my hair page at stranded glamour underscore on Instagram. Um, shop with me, ladies. Thanks, guys, for watching. Peace out.